ओके टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू द प्रैक्टिकल इलेवन ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट मोबाइल एंड वायरलेस कम्युनिकेशन द सब्जेक्ट कोड इज टू टू फाइव थ्री थ्री इन दिस प्रैक्टिकल वी आर गोइंग टू डिटरमाइन द चैनल कैपेसिटी ऑफ द सेलुलर सिस्टम सर्विस एरिया कंपराइज ऑफ फोर सेवन ट्वेल्व माइक्रो सेल्स विथ एट ट्वेल्व सिक्सटीन चैनल्स पर माइक्रो सेल्स ओके ओवर हियर वी आर गोइंग टू कैलकुलेट द कैपेसिटी फॉर दिस माइक्रो सेल्स एंड चैनल्स एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू कंपेयर द रिजल्ट फॉर दिस वी शुड नो वॉट इज द सेल द सेल इज ईच सेल्युलर बेस स्टेशन is allocated a group of radio channels within a small geographical area that is called as the cell okay as the number of users in the cellular system increases the traffic per unit time also increases to allocate the spectrum we use the clusters cells micro cells and the channel now in this diagram you can see this is the cluster of 7 okay in this we are having seven cells in a particular geographical area this is called as the cluster of 7 a b a then b c d e f and g so these are what allocated different this each and every cell will be allocated in different frequency that we can reuse in the next cluster of the same area okay so this is in this particular diagram these are the three clusters of the seven cells now in this practical we are going to calculate the cluster size of 4 capacity of cluster size of 4 capacity of cluster size of 7 and the cluster size of 12 means each and every cluster there will be four cell each and every cluster there will be seven cells and 12 cells okay and with this we are going to calculate for the micro cells that are 8 12 and 16 we have to complete this observation table with after performing the program for this we are going to use the sci lab we are going to do the program after executing the program we will complete this particular table as an observation okay so the program for us okay four cluster size with the eight channel per micro cell then 12 channels per micro cell and 16 channel per micro cell this is all related to your cluster of one means it will be only one cluster which will be having four cells seven cells and the 12 cells with 8 12 and 16 micro cells respectively okay got it so for to execute this particular practical we are going to use the scilabs software to download this particular software the link is given in the description box you can directly download it from that particular link after downloading you will have to type this particular program in this program we are just going to uh, as you know that the capacity is always equal to the multiplication of your number of cells your number of clusters and the channels per cell okay so this is the main formula to calculate your capacity c is equal to in our theoretical aspect c is equal to m into k into n over here in this practical we are using this variables as m k and n okay 
so I'll show you this scilab how we are going to execute it after downloading this scilab you will get the two windows that is console window and the editor window console window will look like this in the editor window you have to type the program this program I already I have typed in the notepad I am just copying it down you can type in the editor window your program the program is also given in the description link now after typing this program you have to save and execute this with that arrow key yes it will ask you to save and execute click on to save and execute give a particular path to save this program once you save it click on to run you will get the console window over here whatever message we have typed in the program that you will able to see now here it is asking you enter the number of clusters so for this we are giving only one one will be the cluster press enter then it will ask next question enter the number of channels per cell so we are doing for eight then it is asking enter the number of cells in a cluster so very first of all we will do it for four four cells so over here you will get the 32 32 is the capacity for eight number of channels of a four cells of one cluster okay similarly you will have to re-execute the program to complete this table uh, again I'll do it for you once again now uh, enter the number of cluster one I'll keep it one only then uh, the channel per sale are the 12 and the cluster size of 4 now you can see it is 48 though the clusters are same only we are increasing the micro cells then also your size of uh, capacity is increasing as you know that the capacity is directly proportional to the number of replications m the cluster size n is typically equal to 4 7 or 12 smaller the n then the smaller will be the capacity to increase the capacity we will have to increase the number of sales number of channels per cell thank you